Alright, what's good ladies and gentlemen, your boy back again in that all black again. Y'all see what time it is, let's go. This is Nicole, welcome Nicole to the show. Now here's the problem. You see... Well, she already looking like she ready to cry about something. There's good news in this story and bad news. You see, last year, Nicole's 43-year-old fiance Arthur won 2500 in the lottery. Man, 2,500, y'all had like it was 25,000, 2,500, and y'all really screaming, woohoo, ah! bro, y'all should have did a few claps and that was it. Here's the good news, he gave her a thousand dollars. Okay. Here's the bad news, Nicole suspects the other 1,500 went on cheating with strippers and strange women. Hey. <laughs> Hey, what you expect, bro? Look at that man and look at her. Do you think he's happy about dealing with her? I ain't even trying to go in on her, but do you think he's happy about dealing with her? What you think he going to do as soon as he get a couple extra dollars in his pocket? He going to go trick on some females that he was never able to get. He not handsome and his female not cute. So, of course, it's what he going to do when he get a couple dollars in his pocket. If that wasn't bad enough, recently Nicole says... Her suspicions have escalated because she now believes Arthur is cheating with her 24-year-old cousin, Courtney. Oh. He ain't had to do that, bro. Come on, bro. That's foul. Out of all the females for you to mess with, you gonna go mess with her cousin? Amazing. Today, the only thing that seems to be growing is Arthur's nose, getting longer and longer like Pinocchio from all the lies he tells. I just gave birth to this man's daughter, and we were supposed to get married two weeks ago. But I'll be damned if I walk down the aisle to the arms of a cheater. He just went okay. to two months ago, and magically, the money disappeared. I think he went out and spent that money on some strippers. On top of that, I think Arthur has... She told him about magically the money disappears. $1,500. How long did it take for him to spend $1,500? Y'all really like he won 50000 or something. But hold on, bro. He cheated with her cousin, bro. She don't look no better than her, bro. This man tripping. <laughs> hey, this man desperate as hell. He couldn't get nothing. He just trying to smash anything but her. He like, man, I've been screwing her for the last three, four years. I wasn't able to get nothing else. Even before her, I wasn't able to get no coochie, so... Hey, I got a couple dollars in my pocket. I'm about to do my thing. Myself to this man. If his ass don't pass this test, he already know what it is. His bags is packed out of the curve. Let's see what the cousin got to say, though. I'm like, the least he could have did was found a female that looked better than her, but all he did was found somebody that was younger. My cousin's permission. She called herself the queen of oral sex. Hello, kitty. But guess what? Today oh, wow. She called herself the queen of oral sex? Hey, who raised you? I love my woman so much, I don't even think about cheating on her. To be honest, I am living the American dream with Nicole. A new baby. Beautiful home. Bro, now nah, he is. She right. That man a liar, bro. That nigga say I'm living. <laughs> that man say I'm living the American dream with Nicole. Bro, you know damn well you're not proud of this woman, bro. No way in hell you proud to be with her. All that cheating nonsense, just throw it out the window. I would never have sex with Courtney. That's Nicole's cousin. What you think? I'm crazy? I love you, baby. Everybody here is Hey, she was right, bro. Old dude is Pinocchio for sure, bro. This man can't stop lying. They don't know me. <laughs> oh, man, get out of here. She should look. He almost sat on the other chair. <laughs> Hell no. Let's see. I love you too much, Nicole. I love you too much. 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 I love you too much.
The cousin talking about she the queen of oral sex. He know he tried to see what that's hitting like. Let me see why you call yourself that. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> hell no. She really over here talking about if you think I was cheating with your man, you wrong and blah. You the queen of oral sex. You call yourself this. Why wouldn't she think something like this? So hold on, what is they going to ask him on the test? Was he just cheating or did he cheat with her? Because she talking about, I hope you pass the test. You should know if you claim you ain't cheat with the dude, you ain't mess with him. What you talking about, you hope? We wanted to get to the truth. So we enlisted the help of our special ops investigator, David Tyler, who is here. <laughs> this is Man. your expertise. Is he the kind of a guy who would cheat on his fiance? He is absolutely the kind of man that would cheat on his fiance. Yeah, he thinking exactly what I'm thinking, bro. Old dude obviously was never able to get the females that he want. He finally got a couple dollars in his pocket and he acting a fool just like any other dude that was never able to get the females that he want. This is how it go, bro. Niggas who never had money, who never had the material things, who never was able to get the females that they want. As soon as they get an opportunity, they gonna go do something, bro. Even if it's with a female that don't look better than her. Just being younger than her, it was worth it for this type of dude, you know what I'm saying? So... I believe what she was saying. She's saying the dude a liar, he Pinocchio and blah, blah, blah. She was telling the truth. Yeah, he talking about he living the American dream with her, man. Get out of here. <laughs> hey. Bro, I told y'all, bro. I knew it from the jump, bro. Man talking about he living the American dream with a female that's not cute in the face. And then on top of that, she overweight. And I ain't just trying to go in on the overweight females because there's some cute big girls out there. But she's not one of them. I'm just going to tell y'all the truth, bro. I can't lie to y'all, bro. And this man talking about he living the American dream. You yeah, okay. <laughs> she talking about now you know now you know you probably still gave him the neck come on bro you knew she was a decoy then why you say that bro that don't even make no sense if you knew she was a decoy why would you say something like that bro this man is a liar Let's go. Now, y'all know how these lie detector tests work, or maybe some of y'all don't know, but from what I hear, I never took one myself, but I heard you can pass these if you're just a good liar. They say if you just know how to be calm when you're telling your lie, then you can pass, you know what I'm saying? But old dude right here, he not really a good liar, so let's see how this goes. you spend the money you won from the lottery on another woman, you said no. The lie detector determined that was a lie. I told y'all, and he gonna still keep on lying. I told y'all, bro, a dude like this, as soon as he get a couple dollars in his pocket, he about to go do what he was never able to do. And he ain't even messing with no bad females. That's the thing that killed me. Like, come on. If I was in his shoes, I'd at least go get a stripper or something, somebody that looked decent, somebody that got a nice body at least. If you ain't going to get something with a nice face, at least get something with a nice body on her. Come on, bro. Another woman when Nicole was visiting her family. Say again, I'm going to drop you. 
I'm going to drop you. <laughs> look, hey, no, look, at, look at that her. She really dropped this man. Body slam is it. sexual intercourse with another woman in the bed you share with Nicole you said no the lie detector determined that was a lie <laughs> amazing oh man she knew this man bro she called it out from the beginning of the video she said he Pinocchio bro his nose keep on growing with all the lies he tell her and she knew exactly what she was talking about but this is who you was dealing with he ain't just start lying Come on now, both of y'all got to get some of this blame. He ain't nothing, but you was dealing with him and you knew what type of dude he was. So, hey, both of y'all on that BS. You was over here about to get married to this dude and you know he a liar. Look at her cousin talking about, wow. If they gonna ask the question about the cousin, did you get the neck from her? She calling herself the oral sex queen. Let's see what they say. Did they ask him that question? Get to the question about the cousin. We asked you, Arthur, during your relationship with Nicole, have you ever had any sexual contact of any kind with her cousin Courtney? Let's go. You said no, the lie detector determined you're telling the truth. Okay, okay, okay. Nah, that's bogus, cuz. <laughs> hey, that's bogus, cuz. Man, what I told y'all from the jump, bro. I told y'all what his type was. I called it out, bro. Your boy be knowing, man. Now, y'all go ahead. Let me know what y'all think about this video in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Your boy, yo.